This video shows you how to create a virtual field, such as a compute or define field, that can be used to create content. A temporary field is a field whose value is not stored in the data source itself, but can be calculated from that data or assigned an absolute value. Temporary fields can be a great way to modify the data you are using for a specific chart or report to provide extra insight. Temporary fields also take up little storage space on the server because they are created as needed. For example, sometimes your data offers useful information that is not part of the data itself, but can be easily extrapolated from it. In such cases, it is possible to add this field to your chart or report alongside the fields already in the master file. You can use a define to create a new field based on fields in your data before the values in them are compiled. For instance, you can combine multiple fields into one in order to consolidate columns such as creating a field for city and state instead of having separate columns for each. To do so, open the Data tab and click Detail Define. When the Expression Builder opens, change the format to alphanumeric and set a character limit that is long enough for all of the values in the field. Fields with words use the alphanumeric format. Time-related fields use the date or date-time format, and numeric fields use one of the other field formats. Once you have set the format, add Customer City to the expression from the list of fields at the right. Click the button to add an absolute value sign, add two single quotes inside it, and type a comma followed by a space inside the quotes. You can then add the State Province field afterward. The absolute value and single quotes will make whatever is inside them constant literal values, while the two fields will supply multiple different values. Title the field and click OK. As you can see, the new Define field appears in the data pane. Add it to the report, retitling the column according to your preference by right-clicking the column header and selecting Column Title. Now you have city and state in one column, properly formatted. You can also create a Define field for a master file when you are in the Edit Metadata step that is part of the data wrangling process. A define field created as part of this process is available whenever the master file is used. A define field created when creating a chart or report will only be available for that chart or report. The other type of virtual field is a compute. This type of field is calculated after everything else has been aggregated. As a result, it uses very few resources to create a compute, and it is the only way to use prefix operator aggregations, such as the average or median operator or create a temporary field from joined data. On the other hand, it can only be used as a sum field and not as a by field. And a computed field appears immediately in your chart or report and not in the data tree. Computes are great for creating numeric fields that can be quickly calculated for your chart or report. For example, maybe you want to make a new field to see the average revenue for each sale. This isn't a field yet, but it can be calculated by dividing the values in the revenue field by the correlating values in the sale units field. To calculate this field, navigate to the Data tab and click Summary Compute. Just add the revenue field to the editor by double-clicking it. Click the Divided By symbol, then add the Sale Units field. Give the computed field a name and click OK. You don't need to change the field format because it is a numeric field with two numbers after the decimal point by default. The computed field appears in the report, and you can rename the column to suit your preference. When you run the report, you will see that both the define field and the compute field contain information synthesized from pre-existing fields in the data source. You can use defines and computes to make more advanced temporary fields, with the ability to create complex numeric, alphanumeric, and date and time fields. If you'd like to find out more, check the resources available in our Information Center.